GM fam, GM. If you don't know what that means, it means good morning. Uh, in the NFT world, a lot of people will start their day in the Discord by saying good morning. So um, anyway, I'm gonna tell you how I made some money on NFTs. I'm pretty new at it, um, but I'll kind of tell you what I've done the last few weeks. Um, I was able to make over $100,000 in unrealized gains. Um, but first, I minted some GM Groundhogs. Shout out to the Groundhogs. They got me into the NFT space, and it's a great community. Um, they're a long-term community, and Roger's awesome. So, um, But I uh, minted 20 of them for one Solana each. And then on Magic Eden, which is the secondary marketplace after they sell out, I was able to get 18 more for three Solana. So I minted 20 at one Solana each, and then I got 18 more at a, around a three Solana average. Um, and then I saw one rare one pop up for 18 Solana, and I bought it. I was able a few days later to sell that rare one for 60 Solana. So I was able to turn the 18 that I paid into 60. I then rolled the 60 Solana into 60 dazed ducks that I minted for one soul each. Um, by the way, soul is for Solana, but I minted them for one each. And now the average on the ducks is 4.5. So I was able to 4.5 X my investment. And on the hogs, they're each worth 10 at minimum. So I was able to turn the original 20 I got for one into 10. And then I was able to turn the 18 additional ones I got for three into 10. So that's a seven soul gain on each of those. So I was able to make about 40 to $50,000 on the hogs. And uh, on the day's ducks, I was able to make 30 to 40,000. Um, and then I also bought some alien friends um, for about a thousand dollars US US dollars each. I got three of them, and they're worth about eight thousand dollars now. Um, but all of this is unrealized gains. I haven't sold. I'm holding on to them. I haven't sold to take the profits, other than the ones that I've sold to roll into other projects. Um, but I don't know exactly how much money I'm into it. I'll have to calculate all that. But I'm pretty sure I'm up over $100,000 if I were to liquidate for the minimum price that these are selling for. And keep in mind, I have uh, 38 hogs and the lowest price is 10 soul, which a lot of mine are rare and they'll sell for higher than that. That's just if I wanted to get the lowest amount. Also, the day's ducks, they pay you residually to hold on to them. You stake the duck on your uh, owner's portal and you get paid 80% uh, of total profits goes back to duck holders that have staked their ducks. So each duck is roughly around uh, $20 in profits right now and you get paid weekly on those. So me just holding on to the ducks, I'll get paid um, back my initial investment. And that, that investment, a lot of it, most of it was off of profits off of one duck that I sold, or one hog that I sold. Anyway, um, it's kind of confusing. Maybe I'll add some pictures to this and make it a little bit easier for you to follow. Um, and then I'll calculate how much money I've made on the hogs right here. And then I'll calculate all the day's ducks, how much I've made in profit here. And then on the aliens, I'll put in the bottom. If you have questions on how to get started, I think the best thing for anyone would be just to join a Discord. It's free. You can join uh, any NFT project for in their Discord. I strongly recommend the GM Groundhogs. They were the ones that got me into it. And the community there is really uplifting and helpful. If you have any questions, you can post it in there and you'll get answers. And I really like that community. Anyway, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just telling you my experience. And if you wanna get into it, the best place to start is join a Discord. Uh, you can join the GM Groundhogs and ask as many questions as you want. You don't have to buy anything. And when you do wanna go buy an NFT, um, there's plenty of people that'll help you know what to buy and um, you'll know what you're buying into. Anyway, take care guys.